guys, this is Sour Productions 47 here. Today I'm going to review set 76099, and this is the Black Panther set with 229 pieces. And this is the Rhino Face Off by the Mind set. And this is probably a pre recorded video, and I'm going to make a stop motion on this. And I'm not going to I'm not gonna include the time lapse because it's probably going to be too short. And yeah, I hope you enjoy this set. And let's just get started. So here's the complete set. My thoughts about this set is that Lego made the po the best possible thing that they could have for this movie. Because they gave us a stick and rhino, which is really cool. And part of the like the train uh the train thing and like the mountain with vibranium in it. They even give us like the supposedly vibranium right here, which is just like a translucent uh, aqua brick. And let's just get on to the minifigures. So here's Black Panther. I really like how like they put the difference between Black, P Black Panther and Killmonger. Because uh, Black Panther doesn't have like that gold stuff on him. And he doesn't have that big of a necklace. And right here it shows like his blueness on there. And uh, I really like how they made it like that color blue. Where his vibranium is all charged up and stuff. And the next minifigure we have is Killmonger. They have kind of like the same design, but Killmonger is more like a gold right now. And uh, and has a, like a bigger necklace. And his face has like more detail on it. And I really like how Lego did that with um, his new details. I think uh, Killmonger is a better, better minifigure than Black Panther. Because he just overall has more detail on him. And I really like how Lego did that. And the final minifigure that we have is Oki Okoye. And she doesn't have that much detail, but she does look like uh, the person from the movie. And I really like how like they made the design on her uh, torso and how they gave her a spear like in the real movie. And they use like black pants like all the time in here. They could Lego could have used like more a uh, detailed pants and better pants, but they did an overall good job on all the minifigures. And let's just get on to the set. So here's the Ryo, and this is obviously my favorite part of the set because like it's just so detailed, and Lego hardly ever gives us Lego animals. And my favorite part about the Rhino is that, like, all, like, the detail right here on the head and stuff. And they give him, like, the ears and the big horns and, like, the eyes, the metal eyes and the breathing holes on the nose. And I really like how they just give it, like, a rugged metal look right there. And how they make it look, like, so detailed on both sides. And they have, like, straps right here if you want to ride it. And you can just easily put a minifigure on top. And yeah, I really like the Rhino. And the next part of this is the mine. And this is actually really good. You can like make a stop motion out of this. Like like how Black Panther should have ended or something. And I, I probably will. By the time this uh, video comes out, I'm probably going to make that stop motion. So be tuned for that. And when you put the when you put the mine cart right at the end and you uh, twist this, then it'll fly off like that off the tracks. And yeah, I really like how they do that. And also they give you like vibranium, which I said at the beginning of this video that like it's just translucent, uh, like aqua bricks. And I really like how they actually give you like a train set. Where you can actually just move it across like that, back and forth. And yeah, this set is a really cool set. That's why I'm going to give it a really cool minifigure rating. And the minifigure that I rate this set would be the clown from series 18. Because the clown is just a really detailed minifigure. And this is a really detailed set. And I really like this set. Even if you're like, uh, you want the set for play features, or you want the set for like displaying, or you just want to keep this in the box, uh, this is a great set for any person. And I really like that how Lego did that. And you can even move the rhino's head for like a, another play feature. 
And yeah, I give this set uh, the clown from series 18. And because the clown is just a really detailed minifigure, this is just a really detailed set. And yeah, stay tuned for the stop motion of this. And yeah, I'm Production 27.